Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to be doing a updates video. Not just a pet updates video, but an updates video about the pets, like I just said. Plants, my little garden I am making. It's cold outside, probably not the best time to start a garden. Winter's coming, but that's not gonna stop me. I am determined to finish this little garden, but there's that. Then we got my cactuses, one died, one is propagating. That's what I'm gonna share so far. And then we have my hamster. So let's get started with that. And before we start this video, I am in my backyard as you can see. And it is quite noisy, so there's wind, all that. But I hope you guys can still hear me okay. So let's get started with the updates. And we're gonna start with my plants. The first plant I have to share with you isn't technically a plant so far it's just a cutting and i am trying to i think he's rotting cuban oregano i picked it from a cuban oregano plant that was at this place with a bunch of different array of plants and i tried to propagate it was doing well so far but there's my little rotting cuban oregano number two is this pothos plant this came off of a cutting from my original pothos plant. It has been in, I think, two previous videos. Um, yeah, I just propagated it, and now we have a new one. These were end pieces, that's why they look so scraggly, and then this one was shorter. These were the two original leaves. All of these three are now new, so that's nice. New leaves are coming. It's kind of hanging off here, but... I have another one that I actually did because I propagated two because I like to propagate these. They're very easy to propagate and they basically survive whatever you do to them. So that's why I like them. Another pothos plant. This one is more recent and it has shorter pieces because I propagated it from the closer to the stem part. This one wasn't hanging off the edge like the other one. This one has bigger leaves and a lot of these leaves are new. Here we have probably my favorite plant out of all of my plants. This is my pea plant. It is a snap pea plant, and as you can see, it is very tall. I may need to repot it. It's been through a lot. It's been repotted twice. It started off in a tiny little succulent pot, and now it is into this, and it might need to be in a bigger pot. But I basically took a clothes hanger, I unraveled it, retied it, and then used this as a little trellis for it to climb up. As you can see, it, it has used its little grabbers. <laughs> it used its little grabbers right there to grab on. So that is my <laughs> very nice pea plant. I don't know when it's going to produce peas. I'm hoping soon. I really like it. Okay, I'm gonna move on to the next one. I'm just showing off my very favorite plant, so. <laughs> Let's go on to the very last one. Well, second last. Next, we have my little radish, and I am very excited about this one because I love radishes. I know that some people don't because they're kind of spicy, but I love them, so I'm growing one. He is very close to being harvested, he just needs to get a little bit fatter. But yeah, this is my radish. I had two in this pot originally, but one did not sprout. I had to cover him up a little bit more with dirt because he was kind of on his last legs. He was coming out of the dirt a little bit too much and you could see like all the pulls. So I had to cover him up a little bit more, but he's doing good. And this is him. He's also very pleasant. I'm very excited about this little radish. So I hope that you guys enjoyed my gorgeous little plants. And I'm going to see you guys when it is later. And my hamster is awake. Now I'm going to show off my succulents. So first, we have this little dude. He's propagating. And he came off of this really sad plant that I have. Next, we have another succulent. 
It has a little pup right there. I'm gonna try to remove it and it's doing pretty good. You may also remember this one. This one is also doing very good. Last and actually very least <laughs> is this very sad succulent. He is not doing very good, as you can see. You may remember him from my Q&A video. I don't know what happened, but yep, this is now what he looks like. And today we are gonna be taking down the little Halloween decorations. I really wanna put up the Christmas wallpaper in the background and some little decorations and make it all snowy inside and pretty and Christmassy, but by the time it's Christmas, I will have to clean this cage again. So I have to wait a little bit more. 